My father's been growing orchids since the 40s, and then we started the business in 1989. So it's been about 30 years now. It was a delight to leave corporate America and go to the plant world because instead of wearing coat and tie and commuting and all that stuff, you know, you're wearing t-shirts and shorts and sandals. There's no hours, there's no clocking in. The plants need attention 24 seven. So you can be out late at night, first thing in the morning. It's a very relaxed atmosphere. The plants thank you infinitely for your care and you see the rewards of your, of your work when they bloom and when they make new leaves. And it's a very rewarding occupation. Well, I didn't know a thing about orchids when I first started. So I asked my dad, what is this? What is this? And now we talk on the phone literally every day. And so we developed this rapport now. It's his passion and it was my business. And once he got me going, he went back to Delaware and said, okay, son, you're on your own. Just call me if you need me. Well, I need him every day. So we chat, but it's, it's the orchids that keep this, this bonding going. The orchid boarding has never been advertised. We, we started growing orchids and selling them. And then people would come back and say, can you take care of my plant for me until it blooms again? Okay, I guess I can do that. And now 13,000 plants later, that's our main business. Everybody seems to want to have their orchid taken care of. And that's our job here is to make all these orchid boarding plants as happy and strong and bloom as soon as possible. You can drop your orchid off anytime, either at our greenhouse or our store. And then we call people and tell them their orchid's ready. And they usually scream, oh, you're kidding. Oh, which one is it? Oh, you know, the key's under my mat. Send it, uh, send it to my beach house or, uh, you know, watch out for the dog, you know, okay, right. So we, um, you know, we have a rapport with these clients. We've been doing this for so long. We're actually on the second generation of our clients. After 30 years, I've, some of my best friends now are my clients in Richmond. And we hang out with them socially and, Everyone wants me to go look at their orchids. You know, before you leave, please check out my orchid and see how it's doing. So I'm traipsing through people's houses in their bathroom, in their foyer, diagnosing their orchid. It's sort of like the orchid doctor. <laughs>